Hi, my name is Aaron Tomhave, and on this week's Tech Tip Tuesday, we're going to take a look at Google Calendar and how to set layers of reminders to keep you on track for your long-term projects. All right, folks, just a quick video with a tip for you that I think will make your life better. Let's say I know that I have reports that I need to turn in on May 12th at 3 o'clock. So I'm going to go into my calendar for May. I'm going to add an activity called reports due, and I'm going to set my time for 2.45 in the afternoon. Now, I don't know about you, but I don't look at my month at a glance view very often in my calendar. It'd be really nice if I gave myself some update reminders so that I can hit my progress points and still be ready to complete my report by the 12th. So you'll notice down at the bottom here, there's a bell for notification that says 30 minutes before. Well, that's great because that's the day of, but you can actually now add notifications as many as you need. So I'm gonna add several here, and then I'm gonna say, okay, I can do custom. And it will allow you to do a notification or an email, and you can now select hours, days, or weeks in advance. So I can click on weeks, and I'm gonna say, hey, I wanna get a notification one week before it's due. I'm gonna give myself a notification that is two weeks before it's due. And I'm gonna put one on here that is three weeks before it's due. So that every Friday for three weeks, prior to my report being due, I'll actually get a notification at 2.45 on Friday afternoon that just says, hey, reminder, your report is due on May 12th at 2.45 p.m. You can have as many as you want and schedule it out as far in advance as you need to. And uh, this has saved me a lot because I'll set a reminder and it tells me I have something that I have to complete in a week and uh, it gives me the opportunity to prepare and complete those things on time. All right, folks, that's all for me today. As always, thank you so much for your time. I hope it was useful and beneficial, and we will catch you next time on Tech Tip Tuesday.